first on the go. St. Bird 3 is back open this morning after a deadly crash shut down the road in Oswego County for much of the night. We know the accident involved a pickup truck and a motorcycle. Deputies were called to this scene in Granby around 6.30 last night. 911 dispatchers tell us it happened along State Route 3 between Hannibal Street and Airport Road. As of now, no other details are being released. In Syracuse, we're learning more about an overnight shooting on the city's west side. Police responding to a call just before 12.30 this morning along the 200 block of Sackett Street. When officers got to the scene, they found a 25-year-old man shot in the back. He was taken to upstate and is expected to survive. Officers also found a bullet in the 900 block of Park Avenue where they believe the shooting actually took place. It was about a month ago when a serious crash caused a Fleetwood cover band to cancel its Syracuse show. But tonight the band is recovered and ready to take the stage again. Seven Wonders will be performing tonight at Middle Ages Brewing. Tickets for tonight's show, $15 online or $20 at the door. Staying on stage, country star Lenny Wilson set a new record for the largest crowd at the State Fair. More than 53,000 people filled Suburban Park to watch her last night. That is 10,000 more people than last year's Nelly concert, which was the previous record. And there are plenty of artists ready to rock the fair today. Starting at the fairgrounds, American Idol alum Alex Miller will kick things off at 1. Then at 6, feel the noise. It's the first heavy metal band to top the Billboard Top 200 chart. At number 1, it's Quiet Riot. And at Suburban Park, Tonic takes the stage at 2. The trio produced one of the most popular songs of the mid-90s. Then at 8, Canadian rockers Theory of a Dead Man will be on stage with its trademark riff rock sound. And finally, across the street, Grammy Award-winning a cappella group Pentatonix takes over the amp at 8. Remember, this is separate from the state fair concerts. A fair ticket will not get you into the amp and vice versa. And if you are heading out to the fairgrounds today, you are in luck. There's a special fair for fair tickets. It's Student Youth Day, so anyone under 18 gets in for free. Just bring your ID.